Just in time for Thanksgiving, it's International Vegetarian Week. Now, this is the everyday diet for many of your favorite stars, but our Matt Babel wanted to know, is the vegetarian root really for everyone? I would never eat an animal. I think that's the saddest thing for me personally me because I've educated myself and now I know a lot of stuff and I could never eat meat ever again. Leah Michelle, Pamela Anderson, Brian Adams, more and more celebrities are going meat free, but is this a fad or a growing movement? Anytime an Alicia Silverstone or a Maggie Q or an Olivia Wilde comes out and says, I'm a vegan and they have the body that looks like that and the skin that looks like that, we see it in clinic. We have an influx of people coming in saying, should I go vegetarian? The queen of vegans is Alicia Silverstone. You look fantastic. I believe my kind diet is what creates this thing that you said. And her butter co-star is now reaping the benefits. I was so like strong and healthy when we were shooting because I was eating all of Alicia's food from her cookbook, which is called The Kind Diet. And Alicia is, is a real hero for, for animals everywhere. Feeling lean and green is also familiar to Nikita star, Maggie Q, who swears by organic foods. You can't be people you love if you don't eat salad. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> That's it. That's, That's it. That's what all the bad guys don't understand. I think some of the myths is that all vegetarians will be B12 deficient. That is a myth. And, and that all vegetarians will be fatigued. That's a myth if you're doing it right. Seaweed is one of the most nutritious things for you. I do that with the black grains and the red grains. And it's, it is fuel for my body. I think that if non-vegetarians want wanted to adapt a little bit of the health benefits from a vegetarian diet, just go higher in vegetables. They can have some protein sources that aren't from flesh proteins. You know, try things like quinoa or lentils or beans. The key is eat clean, eat healthy, eat live. 